Isn't this the cop that was the asshole? Gave him his car back. That's how he's making amends. Who you know who does it better than this? I'm the boy who doesn't get it. I'm on top of the list. Trying to get a good signal like a satellite dish. Every day to me. It's like a solar eclipse. Uh -uh. What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Leon. I'm cool as African geek. Welcome to my channel. The sixth episode. I've legit watched six episodes. Recorded them. And I'm going to edit them after. <laughs> it's it's going to be a long ass night. Though. <laughs> it's like how many... It's like... Let me check. <laughs> Let me be sure I forgot that I'm recording myself on something that has a clock. I was about to guess the time. It's 2.30 a.m. right now. Probably going to sleep at 6. <laughs> anyway, uh, previous episode ended so so cliffhanger -y, like all of them have been. I think uh, Sarah's dad's going down. Her brother got threatened. I think that's going to make him go all over the edge. I'd be surprised if Sarah's ex survives the season <laughs> with, with a brother that that's such a loose cannon and being threatened by that dude. Ah, uh, John B. I think he's about to be a free man. Do you think that other cop was playing the long game with the FBI agent? But damn, the kid almost died so many times while they were sitting back and letting shit happen and letting people fuck up. Uh, Pope and uh, and Kara, something's gonna happen, I guess, <laughs> with them. They keep something happening, they're pulling apart, something happened. Kara and her family situation, that shit is terrible. <laughs> he got kicked out of the house for believing in their friends. Oh, goddamn. I wonder if her mother's gonna come back. Like, forgive me when the truth comes out. I wonder how the cops are gonna act to JB or the town, even. Goddamn, they owe these kids so much now. <laughs> anyway, let's not waste any more time. Dive right in. Still in prison? Oh yeah, he started writing his life story, thinking he was gonna die. You a free man. They're still treating him bad. He don't trust nobody now. <laughs> Goddamn. Isn't this the cop that was the asshole? Gave him his car back. That's how he's making amends. I, I mean, it's a nice gesture, but you did something fucked up to a teenager. Giving him his car back is not enough. Uh, John P's gonna be the bigger guy, I suppose. They're giving him warm welcomes now. This is a weird way to start the episode. It's so warm. You just almost got murdered last night, dude. You're too happy. It feels like a whole new show. <laughs> Comparing it to the previous episode. They didn't even go look for her. She's getting breakfast in bed from her ex. <laughs> Like tonally from the previous episode, how intensely the way it ended, <laughs> this happy sun in my face <laughs> that's happening, <laughs> it's so weird. Oh man, move on, bruv. No, she's your first love, but she got married. <laughs> God damn. So Rafe is going down, not him. So the money is still in play. SPI. Damn. I thought it was the FBI, but it's the SPI. Even him telling the story doesn't fit with this new tone. <laughs> is he jealous now? Oh man, back to the love triangles. <laughs> They're coming after the race. Good. There's still beef between the classes. Ah, uh, that's funny. They married. I'm, I'm with him. Damn. You guys clear on that? Yo. Why did Sarah say that to spare his feelings? 
Oh shit. Oh, it's the dude who needs who was looking for the key. Okay, I'm sorry. I but she made a conscious decision. Sarah. Now we Sarah. only dealing with the teen drama. You want a shotgun one in the name of freedom? She's mad too. The room. On fire. It was perfect. What did she keep like pulling away? So it wasn't good? Is she breaking up with him? <laughs> God damn. We starting everything over? Oh my gosh, she's so oblivious. Yo, he got dumped and he's dead. Something happened. Take a beat. It's a new treasure hunt. So we're starting all over with every relationship. <laughs> That's a weird decision, but they got like five more episodes. I understand. These siblings? Just talking all that shit. <laughs> then passes out. She's talking to her shit again. This dude is probably in the trunk of the car. May I go? He's gonna escape at the car wash. I knew he was in the trunk. Are they all not talking to each other. Where do we go? So this mystery is making them talk to each other. Today, aren't we? God damn, that was petty. <laughs> It's actually about his family this time. First it was John B's family. I guess other families are kinda involved in the story. JJ and his dad. You mind if I talk Is she even gonna be any help? She looks like she remembered something and got scared. God damn. How did they end up in the situation they're in? Let's hear this plan. Of course. They talking shit about them. So they were in they in hiding. They're gonna meet up and do what exactly? Your son is fucked. <laughs> Is he gonna confess that he tried to kill Sarah? I believe you. This dude's gonna overdose or something. You're gonna have all the time in the world to show me too, right? Or the dude is gonna turn him in. I mean, like the show, that's the guy listening in the trailer. That has to lead to something. Now you're all shoes, sir. Cap. <laughs> you don't choose him. This dude chooses the gold. It's one man, yo. Okay. Why are they such a threat right now? <laughs> She's speaking so much shit, though. I don't understand why they're scared of her. <laughs> They've all made up now. They gonna take me alive? God damn. Dude is happy talking about killing. What the hell has happened? Ooh. Damn. I knew he was going to turn him in. Him listening made had to mean something. He's running? They can't shoot him now. He's unarmed. He he got caught, got. Okay. Weezy, we got to think of her. The level in which this gold has become so useless in the story. <laughs> and it was such an inciting incident. Is he gonna want the family? It's her dad still. He's even hiding the cars from Tapa. Hey, Sarah. Father, hey, talk to 
God damn. Why is she shocked that he celebrated this? Your dad tried to kill him so many times. I hope people don't start acting mad out of character. Damn, she's listening to her older sister. She's confessing. Dude is running. Damn. Why do I feel like he faked his death? Like immediately as it happened, I don't think, oh, he's dead. It was too convenient. I don't think he's dead. What was that look? She expected him to comfort her. Jambi has been through a lot, duh. Everybody has. Should I just watch the whole season and edit it tomorrow? <laughs> they ended with a loving memory to somebody. I don't know who that is, but RIP to that person. RIP to the VIP. See these cliffhanger endings? They got me watching the whole season in one day. Imagine that shit. Got four more episodes. It's like 3 a.m. right now. Let me see. Oh, I'm considering it. All the relationships are basically falling apart in one episode. Like everybody's acting so out of character. Sarah, you were with him trying to take him down, but now that he's he's successfully did it. And he's actually celebrating. It's affecting you negatively. And you're not even telling him why it's affecting you. You expect him to read your mind. Like apparently Topper does. <laughs> Man, this is not the love triangle I expected to get this season. I'm sure fans are going to be mad, mad. <laughs> mad, mad. Mm. I'm wondering with Kira since the actress playing her. Is part of the uh, LG, <laughs> you know, the community, the alphabet community. <laughs> They're gonna make her character gay. You know what I'm saying? I feel like they all shouldn't date each other. They all shouldn't be friends even right now. <laughs> Should be guys and girls separated. <laughs> It's healthier since they dated each other for at least a while until they move on. <laughs> am I making sense right now? I think I am making sense, but I'm also mad tired. But I'm definitely finishing this shit 